What did the inventor of the telephone say before he died? Nothing. Unable to speak, Alexander Graham Bell traced with his fingers the sign, No, in response to his deaf wife as she mouthed the words to him, Don't leave me. As professor of vocal physiology at Boston University, Alexander Graham Bell trained teachers in the art of instructing the deaf how to speak, encouraging speech therapy and lip reading over sign language. Bell had many deaf pupils, including Mabel Hubbard, who later became his wife. He undertook telecommunication experiments which led to the development of the telephone in an attempt to restore her hearing, which had been destroyed by a near-fatal bout of scarlet fever as a child, leaving her completely deaf for the rest of her life. As he lay dying from complications of diabetes, Bell continued dictating to his wife. Asked about his rush to finish, Bell replied, But I have to. So little done. So much to do.